Hello, welcome back to Brocrest. Today we're playing Adventures with Anxiety by Nutcase Nightmare. I'll put a link in the description. Oh, we're eating a sandwich. It's good, it's good. Playtime 30 Minutes mm -hmm. by Nikki Case and Monts Plesia. Okay, uh, let's play. Welcome. This is less of a game, more of an interactive story. Hope you like reading, sucker. So before we start, how would you like to read? What? Speak this fast. What? Alright, eh, all the way. And advance on... Click? Okay. Great note. Great note. You can always change options with the gear icon below. Also, game auto saves at each chapter. Now let's begin our story. This is a human. And this is the human anxiety jacket. You are the anxiety. Oh good, my wolf's back. Fantastic. Your job is to protect your human from danger. In fact, that sandwich is putting them in danger right now. Quick, warn them. Human, listen, we're in danger. The danger is... Let your anxiety come out to play. Pick what's most similar to what your fear tells you. We're eating alone for lunch again? Eh, that's fine. We're not productive while eating? Uh, that one. We're not productive while eating. We put your laptop and do some work right now. Um, I'd rather not get crumbs in my keep, or if we're not contributing to the body of society, then we're a society parasite. The society body will go to the society doctor for medication to kill the society par parasite, then we'll die. Bad. Oh, you used fear of being a bad person. It's super effective. See, human, I am your loyal guard wolf. Trust your gut. Your feelings are always valid. Get your human's energy bar to zero. To protect their physical and social moral needs, you can use fear of being harmed, fear of being unloved, fear of being a bad person. Pro tip, play the choices that personally hit your deepest, darkest fears. Ooh, we're gonna learn something about me today. You know, you know what? Maybe it's time to check my phone. Protect your human from the world, from other people, from themselves. Good luck. Round one, fight! Oh. Huh, Facebook feed says there's a party happening this weekend. Doesn't that weirder throw a party every weekend? What inner void are they trying to fill? They must be deeply messed up inside. Also, I got an invite? Well then. Say yes or we're we'll definitely loneliness. to say no, it's full of poisonous drugs. Ignore it, we make parties sad. I don't feel that way, but I feel like that's the most effective. All we ever do at parties is worry about how we should be productive instead. Gee, I wonder why. Sorry. So if we go, we'll make them feel bad, but if we reject their invite, we'll also make them feel bad. All we do is make people feel bad, so we should feel bad. Bad. Ugh. If it'll make you shut up, fine. I'll ignore the invite. Anyway, Facebook's too much. I need something calm, less anxiety producing. What's new on Twitter? Oh, look at that horrible news story. Oh no, is that too about us? Hey, a gift. No, because we don't want the good gift. Uh, horrible news story. Oh no, look at that horrible news story. God, it feels like the world's burning, isn't it? It feels like it's all ending, like everything's dying and we're doomed, and there's nothing we can do about it. Let's retweet that story. Harm. I don't know how that's harmful. Okay, I'll retweet it. Just please be quiet. Screw it. Let's look at Snapchat. Huh. Photos from yesterday night. So that's what those weekly parties are like. Hmm. That looks really fun. Maybe I shouldn't have ignored the invite. Uh, actually say yes. Maybe I shouldn't have... It's kind of rude to keep ignoring them though, no? Well, other people always ignore us, so... Unloved! Oh my goodness. Okay, so let's just call it even. Whatever, new Tinder notification. What's the hookup app? Ah, what? The hookup app? 
It's not a hookup app, it's just a way to meet new people. It's a hookup app. Oh, I got a match, it looked cute. Please don't ruin this for me. Danger, danger, danger! Uh, we're just using other people. You think other people's genitals are Pokemon for us to collect? Oh, it's copyrighted. Skip, 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 skip. This is gonna get muted. I'm not singing that. This is... <laughs> that is fun. Oh my goodness. <laughs> That's funny. Uh... The point is, we're a manipulative creep. That song's gonna get cut out. But I'll try to keep the words in. That was pretty funny. Alright, we'll feel bad. Ooh, I'm so sick of this game. We're a society parasite. We're a society parasite. The world is burning. A crappy parody song. I just want to live my life. I just want to be free from all this pain. Hey, human? It'll be okay. As your loyal guard wolf, I'll always keep an eye out for danger and do my best to keep you safe. I promise. Last tap. Instagram. What you got? It's more party pictures. Everyone looks so happy, free from worry, free from anxiety. God, why can't I be like them? Why can't I just be normal? Speaking of parties, about this weekend's invite, here's my final decision. We should not go. Oh, uh, what? Oh. Okay, okay. You're not in control of me. Now excuse me while I eat this delicious sandwich in peace. Nice. Uh, everyone hates us. On love, that's a win. See, you can't beat that. See, you can't prove it or deny it. Alright, we made it past the first round. Congratulations. You successfully protected the human's physical and social and moral needs. Why, well, look at how grateful they are. Now that now that their energy is zero, you can directly control their actions. Picking your end, pick your ending move. Finish them. Uh, fight. Zuckerberg and Co are hijacking your mental health for venture capital to some money. Punish your phone, destroy it, kill it. My goodness. I win, but at what cost? Um, that was an interesting game. I'm not going to continue. I feel like this game pushes you to be a toxic person. And unfortunately, that was very easy for me. Um, but it is interesting. It kind of makes you think about the stuff that gets to us. The, and mainly how we get to ourselves. Uh, we overthink a lot of situations instead of just trying to enjoy them. So, I don't know. I've never personally dealt with anxiety. Or at least not this bad. So, I can't really relate. But if you feel like you've been dealing with anxiety or do deal with anxiety, you know, talk to someone, reach out to someone that you care about or that, you know, cares about you. And if you feel like no one cares about you, believe me, someone does. OK. Uh, but yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, and let's see what we'll play in the next video. Please share this video and uh, like it, subscribe. And if you need help, reach out to someone. All right, bye.